be perfectly honest, I am more excited that right here in front of us is the University of Washington Husky national champion softball and cross country yeah. women's team. Thank you all so much for being out here. I am so proud to be your voice and your advocate and fight for all of you in Washington, D.C. And I can't wait to have a big victory on November 2nd and go back and keep working for all of you. And with your help and your support, go out and talk to your neighbors and your friends and get those ballots in so we can have a celebration like you all had here in the Husky Stadium last Saturday night. Two overtimes. Big win. Do it again November 2nd. Mr. President, we know something about winning here. You don't win by sitting back and hoping it's going to happen. You get out, you work hard, you have grit, you have determination, and you keep going till you get there. And it happens right here in this stadium with our great Husky team. You know, the President and I know a little bit about this. When you get the kickoff in the end zone, way behind, and you got to pick it up, and you got to get it all the way to the other end, kind of happened to us when when he became president and we got this little football from the Bush administration way back in the end zone. Had to pick it up and play by play by hard-earned yard to hard-earned yard, get it up the field to the 50-yard line, and it was tough work. Well, I'll tell you what, when you get to the 50-yard line, you don't say, shoo, that was hard, I'm going home. You don't say, I don't like that last play, I'm giving up. You pick up that football and you keep going and you get your team together until you get it into the end zone and that's what we're doing under the leadership of this president. You don't win by saying no. We win by saying yes you can. Yes you can. I am delighted to introduce to all of you the president who has a vision.